using the power of authenticity to change your life. Well, good morning, everybody. It's Maria Patron, and I have you on my beautiful walk this morning. I'm here taking a walk, getting my exercise in, see the beautiful the sunrise. The only thing I love better than a sunset is a sunrise. So this is what you're coming on in my journey this morning with me. And people ask all the time, what is something that you can do to change your life, to change your, where you are? So the number one thing is start with you. Everything starts with you, everything ends with you. You're not where you are in your life, pick up the mirror, take a look at it, and that's whose fault it is. When fault, you say it's fault, you can say whatever you want it is. The reality is that we are the director of our own movie. And the more that we can be authentic in who we are in our own movie, the better the movie's gonna be. Nobody wants to see somebody who you think they wanna see. They wanna know you. They want to know me. They, want it, they don't want you behind a mask, pretending to be this and that, and posting your social pictures and all fancy and this and that, or did this. People want to know who you are. They want to know what you believe in. They want to know what you desire. And being authentic is the way to get there. I've always said this, good, bad, or indifferent, I wear my heart on my sleeve. What does that mean? It means I've always been a person to tell you like it is. I'm not sure why. Like my grandmother, my nana, Rose, I think she was pretty much like that. My dad's like that too. You always know where you stand, these people. And I hope that people always know where they stand with me. I wanted to talk about this this morning because I don't think there's anything better than authenticity and personal development. See, you want to grow your real estate business, the most important thing is to grow yourself. And you probably don't want to hear that because you want to think that it's some shiny object that's going to change and there's nothing that's gonna change unless you do. And I'm <clears throat> gonna remember, you are the director of your own life. You get to choose who's in it. You get to choose who's not in it. You get to cast the, cast the characters. You get to rewrite your story today if you wanna rewrite your story today. That's up to you. I want you to remember that. People feel so locked and in, in prison of their own life. You're not. I was that way too, by the way. I was like, I felt somewhat a little bit that way. Now look, I'm on my walk this morning showing you this because I want to show you. Hold on. Look at this. And the view. This is how I'm starting my day. You know why? You know why I'm starting my day like this? Because I want to, and it's my life. And I get to, <clears throat> to do what I feel good about doing. And so I'm starting my day with a walk. And I happen to be down the shore. I'm going back in a little while, uh, after my walk actually, shower and get out of here. But I'm gonna do me. I'm not gonna be rushing off, rushing away. Everybody's rushing. Rushing, rushing, rushing. Rushing here, rushing there. What? Stop. You're running around too much. We're not even thinking about our life. I asked somebody, what is it that you want for your life? You know, most people can't answer that question. What do you want? Not what you don't want. Tell me what you want. 
Tell me what it looks like. Can you see it? Can you envision it? Believe it's already happened. Most people don't even know. They don't even have goals written down. Come on. This is it, everybody. You got this life and that's it. As far as I know. Maybe there's others, but I digress. This is the one that we have now. And I want you to live it in authenticity. I want you to live it in love. Because love, besides love, I guess somebody asked the other day, what is the highest frequency you can be on? Somebody said, love. The answer is authenticity. When you are authentic, you draw people to you. Because they want, they want, people crave. They are craving for somebody to be real with them and tell them the truth. Everybody goes around now. Nobody wants to say anything that isn't correct. And if people feel, you know, correct of this, forget about it. Remember, you're the director of your own life. You can have and be and do whatever you want. But you got to believe it. you got to believe it. And if you don't believe it, it's not going to happen. Sorry to tell you. But if you do believe it, it will happen for you. It's already done. You just have to believe it and believe in what it is, crystal clear and in detail, what it is that you desire. And being authentic is the number one way for you to get there in authenticity and in love and who cares what everybody else is doing or thinks they think about oh well, Maria she's on the beach taking a walk yeah but you know it's important to me is taking care of myself serving myself first I serve so many people for so long in my life and I kind of got a little lost in there but not no more some people aren't going to like the way I show up. It's okay. I'm not here to serve them. I'm here to serve the people who, who want to be connected. And who want to learn and who want more. Because it's, it's ours for the taking. It's ours for the taking. So with this, this week, I want you to think about how can you be authentic in your life? How can you serve yourself first? What can you do to serve yourself first? And what can you start to do to be and show your authenticity? I will let you think about that. Give you a little here. That's what I'm looking at right now. The beautiful sun. Listen to the sound of the waves. How is that not such a beautiful thing first thing in the morning? Let's have a great week, everybody. Remember, you are the director of your life. It's your movie. You get to decide. I hope you live in love and authenticity this week. God bless. And let's have a fantastic week, everybody.